Hello, and today we're going to, hello everybody, today we're going to be checking out Force Field, one of my old plugins. We're going to go ahead and download it off the spigot right now. It doesn't require any defense or anything. You just got to download it, press keep, drag it into your plugins folder, and start the server. That's pretty much all you got to do. Now we're going to load up Minecraft on two different accounts, because what this plugin kind of does is it's kind of like an old Mineplex type plugin, where um, you, if a ena player enables it, it's going to bounce everybody around them off, um, off of where they are. So that's pretty much what it does. So we're gonna wait for my ultimate editor account to log on and see. All the permissions are on the plugin on the plugin page. Uh, there is a configure file where you can configure everything about the knockback radius, the volume, the sounds that it says, the messages, everything like that. The permissions for this plugin um, and the commands are slash force field and slash force field reload. It tells you what they do right here. Slash force field um, enables and disables the force field and slash force field reload reloads the configure files to default. The permissions is ff.use to use it, ff.reload to reload, use the reload command, and ff.ignore to ignore the force field that bounces you around. So pretty much, we're going to let my alternate account join here. This is going to be the person with... Ah, forgot about that. Okay, let me do this real quick. Hopefully, I spawn there. Yes, I do. Alright, so this is my main account over here, which has the permission um, to go ahead and knock back this player. So I'm standing here, you see. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do select force field. So I'm going to bounce back. So if I try to get in the range of this that we set in the configure file, I'm going to get bounced back. Um, this is meant to be used on hub servers. That's why I do take fall damage on here because I haven't disabled it on this server. I recommend you only put this on like servers or you can just add a plugin that disables fall damage so you don't have what I'm doing right now. But um, it just bounces you off. You can't get in the range of them unless you have the permission ff.ignore and then if they go ahead and toggle it off you are able to walk up to them if you're standing next to them when they enable it it will just bounce you back away from them um, so if you have a bunch of players it's gonna do the same thing they did on Mineplex a while ago and uh, bounce you back to there so um, that's it for this one uh, I can't spell oh that's not the command shoot okay well I uninstalled everything on the server. That's the plugin pretty much. If you have any questions about it, you can join the Discord server. We, we aren't planning to update this in a while unless we recode the entire plugin. It was made a very long time ago. It was one of the first plugins uh, VGHD development actually released. So that is it for today's plugin tutorial. Hopefully you did enjoy. We have a few um, non-plugin type videos, I believe, coming out this week. I think I may do a Sea of Thieves game or something. We'll see. Okay, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.